Hi and welcome to day 8 of PD365. I can't believe we've made it a whole week um, without stopping, which is insane. I mean, I've never stuck at anything this long, I don't think ever. Um, definitely not exercise, definitely not diets, definitely not anything like that. So uh, it's quite good going, I think. Um, I just want to say a massive thank you to everyone who's supported us so far, who's been kind of sharing our links, who's been tweeting about us, who's kind of written articles about us or put us on the radio. Thank you to everyone who's been subscribing. Um, thank you to everyone who's been sharing. Thank you to everyone who emailed and said, or messaged me and said, where's this video on this day? Because that means you care and you're actually watching. So thank you, greatly appreciated. I thought on day eight, after a whole week, I'd just do a quick summary of um, what I've learned so far about my condition through these kind of making videos for these eight days. Um, first thing I've learned is that actually Parkinson's doesn't rule my day as much as I thought it did. I don't kind of wake up in the morning and go to bed each day thinking, oh, that was incredibly frustrating. You know, Parkinson's really annoyed me today. I'm going to bed thinking about all the things that I've shown you. They're the things that honestly and truthfully are the high points of my day. Um, and actually Parkinson's is like a sub note to all those things. It's something that is a minor annoyance on most days. And I thought I was kind of further progressed than that. So actually that's kind of a relief to me that I can still relatively get on with my day without it bothering me too much. Um, and also just the fun I'm having in making the videos is kind of looking at each day as a story and seeing, you know, what kind of story I can tell throughout the day and sort of what the key things are that I've absolutely loved about that day. And that's really fun to kind of look at your life in that way and to share it with other people. Um, so one week down, 51 to go if my maths is correct. My maths is never correct, so we'll see. But that seems completely achievable now having done one week and really fun and actually when I was thinking about it earlier I was thinking you know that's not that long I might be really sad when it finishes there might be a PD365 take two next year who, who knows but I'm um, absolutely loving it really enjoying it I think David's enjoying it too he's gone off on his holiday so uh, if he's gonna make any videos it'll probably be of him sipping sangria or San Miguel or something by a pool which I'll be incredibly jealous of but I'm um, excited to start next week and see what happens and share it with all of you. But thank you so much for continuing to watch, continuing to subscribe, continuing to share it with your friends. And um, yeah, I hope we're kind of raising awareness to people that don't know about the condition and people that do know about the condition alike. If you have any kind of comments or anything, please continue to comment, uh, reach out to us on social media. Um, if you have anything we'd, you'd like us to cover in particular, any kind of questions you have, and that would be great as well. Just uh, tweet us at hashtag PD365 uh, to myself or David and we'll, we'll try and cover it.